So this question is a simultaneous equations question, um, but it doesn't kind of look like the stereotypical simultaneous equation question um, because we're given a context for this. Um, however, if you imagine S represents the uh, price of the gumbo sweets and C represents the uh, price of the raspberry chocolates, what we can do is we can write these two pieces of information as this. So two lots of the S plus five lots of the C equals, and I'm just going to leave it in pence rather than pounds. I find pence a lot easier to work with. And then we can write the second one as four lots of the sweets plus three lots of the chocolates equals 220. So to do simultaneous equations, you need one of the coefficients to be the same. Um, looking at the S and the C, uh, to get the C's the same, I'd need to times the top, uh, all the numbers at the top by 3 and all the numbers on the bottom by 5 to get them both to 15. But if I look at the S, that's 2 and that's 4, so all I need to do is times everything in this first one by 2, and it would get these um, S's the same. So I'm going to times 5C by 2. And I'm going to times the 180 by 2, which would be 360. Um, so to get rid of the S here, so I'm just going to try and make this a bit clearer about what, where we're looking now. So we're looking, I might do a little bit further up, we're looking at this part here. <clears throat> now to make things a little bit clearer, when I subtract, um, which I'm going to do to get rid of the four S's, um, we're going to have a bit of a problem because everything's going to be negative. So sometimes it's a good idea just to copy down the first equation again. So 4s plus, which is technically the second equation again. Oh, let me just rub that out. Uh, there we go. Uh, so 220. So I'm just copying it again so that when I subtract, which I will do, it can just make it a bit, um, well, make them positive, so make it a bit easier. At this stage, we work downwards. So we're working downwards. We're looking at these two, these two, and these two. And with simultaneous equations, you're always working downwards. Now, we need to get rid of the 4s, and that's the whole point of doing this with simultaneous equations. Um, and there's a little rule that if the coefficients are positive, so uh, they're both the same, or both of them are negative, so they're both the same, same means subtract. So just remember that, same coefficient, same sign, subtract. If the signs are different, so one's positive, one's negative, if they're different, the D in different is the D in add. So if they're different, you'd add them. But these are both the same, as we can see. So we're going to subtract them. So we're going to subtract all of these three. So 4S take away 4S is nothing, which is great. We want to get rid of those. 10c take away 3c is 7c, and 360 take away 220 is going to be 140. So I'm going to get my lines in now, so I can solve this. And to um, get rid of this times 7 here, we're going to divide both sides by 7. So we've got c equals, and 14 divided by 7 is 2, so 140 divided by 7 is going to be 20. So C, the raspberry chocolate, is going to be 20 pence or 0 0.20 pounds. Okay, but we need to work out what the price of the gumbo sweets are going to be. So what we do is we pick one of the original equations, and I'm trying to think what's going to be easier. So I like this one. So we're going to rewrite this, but instead of C, we're going to substitute in the 20. So it's going to be 2S, which we still don't know what S is plus 5 times 20, which is 100, equals 180. Get my lines in. Okay, so first of all, we're going to get rid of that 100, so we're going to take away 100 both sides. So 2s equals 80, and then that's a times 2 there, so we've got to divide by 2 both sides. So s equals 80 divided by 2, which is 40. And so once it in pounds, that's going to be 0 0.40 pounds. Now you can check this by putting both of these uh, numbers into the second equation and check that it works. So 4 times s, which would be uh, 4 times 4, 1 pound 60, plus 3 times c, 
which is going to be 60p, add the two together and you get £2.20.